Drug of the Day Montelukast Montelukast is in a class of medications called leukotriene receptor antagonists. It works by blocking the action of substances in the body that cause the symptoms of asthma and allergic rhinitis. FDA Investigation of Montelukast In June 2009, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration concluded a review into the possibility of neuropsychiatric side effects with leukotriene modulator drugs. In September 2019, the Pediatric Advisory Committee and the Drug Safety and Risk Management Advisory Committee met to discuss a pediatric-focused safety review of neuropsychiatric events with Montelukast. In March 2020, the FDA required a boxed warning for Montelukast to strengthen an existing warning about the risk of neuropsychiatric events associated with the drug in the wake of an increase in case reporting of neuropsychiatric events around the time of the initial communications about the concern from FDA in 2008. Pharmacology Montelukast is in the leukotriene receptor antagonist family of medications. It works by blocking the action of leukotriene D4 in the lungs resulting in decreased inflammation and relaxation of smooth muscle. Pharmacokinetics Route of administration, by mouth Bioavailability, 63-73% Protein binding, 99% Elimination half-life, 2.7-5.5 hours Excretion, biliary excretion Medical uses Montelukast is used for a number of conditions including asthma, exercise-induced bronchospasm, allergic rhinitis, and urticaria. It is mainly used as a complementary therapy in adults in addition to inhaled corticosteroids, if inhaled steroids alone do not bring the desired effect. It is also used to prevent allergic reactions and asthma flare-ups during the administration of intravenous immunoglobulin. Montelukast is usually taken once a day with or without food. Usual adult dose of Montelukast. 10 mg orally once a day. For asthma, efficacy has been demonstrated when this drug was administered in the evening without regard to time of food ingestion. For allergic rhinitis, efficacy has been demonstrated for asthma when this drug was administered in the morning or evening without regard to time of food ingestion. Patients with both asthma and allergic rhinitis should take only one dose daily in the evening. Common side effects include diarrhea, nausea, vomiting, mild rashes, asymptomatic elevations in liver enzymes, and fever. Rare may affect up to 1 in 10,000 people taking Montelukast, but serious side effects include behavioral changes including suicidal thoughts, angia edema, erythema multiform, and liver problems. Drug Interactions Montelukast has very few drug-drug interactions. This is due to the lack of off-target affinity towards other targets in the body where it might exert an effect. However, it is important to note that Montelukast is an inhibitor of the drug metabolizing enzyme cytochrome P2C8. Therefore, it is theoretically possible that the combination of Montelukast with a cytochrome P2C8 substrate could increase the plasma concentrations of the substrate. So, that's for today. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.